Well, I'm absolutely delighted now to be joined by Justine Ennis. She's a seven-time Grand Slam champion, and just last year she was inducted into the Tennis Hall of Fame. But today, Justine, you've got to show off for our viewers. You got your Hall of Fame ring, right? Yeah, it's very emotional. It's been a great memory last year being honored by the, the Tennis Hall of Fame. Uh, that place is just unbelievable in, in Newport. Being, feeling the history of the game and uh, and being part of it is something really that I uh, I am proud of and. Uh, being here in Wimbledon, getting this ring, and uh, here in this atmosphere, it, it's a bit special because it's here that I, it's the only Grand Slam I never won, so it's a little bit special, it happens here, and uh, but I, and uh, being part, for, for the little girl that was dreaming, being part of the history of the game, it's something much more than what I could expect for. Tell me for you, coming back to Wimbledon, you were a two-time finalist here. What are the memories that come back when you're at the All England Club? It's a lot of memories. It was here that I played my first Grand Slam final. I was 19. I lost to Venus. And uh, that day I, I heard that my, my grandfather died, unfortunately. So uh, a lot of emotions, positive, a little bit uh, negative also, but always a lot of pleasure to come back here because the, the crowd here all... I mean, the respect uh, they have for the game, for the tennis. And when I played here, I always had a lot of support. And the, the tradition of the game, we can feel it so deeply that uh, it's only only joy to, to be back here. Yeah. Congratulations once again, the Hall of Fame. You get your ring now to go along with your induction a year ago. And what an honor to see you back at Wimbledon. We hope that you come back year after year. Thank you very much.